I, I don't have these memorized at all. So I, I will be pressing every single one, hoping that it's the way up. But I'm never going to be sure. Liquid Flame! Oh no! And me without anybody to cast Blizzard on it. Oh well. I'll manage. I think Krillstone may need some healing. Yeah, just a little bit though. Blaze! Actually, that was pretty damn powerful. Did not expect that. Go S shot. Finish the job for me. Defeat the liquid flame. Still not enough. We are encountering some high end enemies here, aren't we? When even 4,800 is not going to be enough. Yeah, you can just steal out of. Uh, you can mug out of habit. It's not like it is any less than a regular attack. So, you know, I just do it out of habit. Oh, I was about to say, who's he casting that on? Oh, himself, of course. Uh, we're going to continue to go for it. Or even though one of them missed, and that pretty much put it back to, to normal, and then S shot once again should do a lot of work for me, and down goes the liquid flame out of the wall. You have 625 experience, 5 ability points for that fight. I do believe that is because I pressed X on the uh, on the wrong wall. But like I said, I don't have it memorized. Ah, no! It was the right one! Now, these guys... They do have money in them. 5,000 gil out of that one. Do we have more new enemies? Yes! Let's say no, but Sherry in the back. She is new. We got another prison dress out of that. I will have to check those. I don't remember if those are actually good for me or not. Uh, I bet they are. I bet they are upgrades that I will want to use. Go Earth! Sonic Boom! That is a worthwhile Sonic Boom. Nicely done. Guile has taught you well. Enough for the victory? Yes. Very nice. Thing oh, Day's Dance. You put Raina to sleep. Damn it, it was her turn next, too. Um, I don't know. Yourself. You have the lowest amount of HP. Everybody needs to be healed. Thanks for that blaze. And that should do it. That should do it. Wind Slash for the win. No! So let's just be safe and go for a shot. 4,800 as opposed to, I think, 2,500, give or take. That is always better. You get 1167 gil, 750 experience, and 3 ability points. Raina gains a level. Hooray! She's still far behind. There's no other way to put it. She's still a little bit far behind. And I, I do like using the, the Brave Blade because it does have 150 exactly uh, battle damage, which helps me in fights. This fight again, now. And in this pot over here, we have monsters! Is that going to be tough? Oh, that doesn't sound tough to me. This is the Magic Pot. Now, the Magic Pot is a unique enemy in this game. You don't want to hit it. That's the best thing that I can tell you about it. Well, as we wait for him to say what we need to do. There we go. Give him elixirs. And be careful. Don't waste these on yourselves. They are very expensive. I almost don't want to even use them on him, but... That's what you're supposed to do. So let's go ahead and do it. There is a good good purpose that comes out of this, though. So, let's give him another elixir. Is that it? Is that all you want? There we go. And then he runs away. Yes! And for that battle, you get 100 ability points. Ridiculous. Well worth the, the three elixirs, if you ask me. Just the one level up, though. That's how far behind everybody else is on leveling, or how how much they require. But we do get a phoenix down out of the out of the pot for that. Um, yeah, she's gonna stick on on summoner, but uh, we did get summon five to move forward. But yeah, look how far everybody is. Bart's is next. He will get knight fairly shortly. Hopefully, I don't waste too much on that. And let's just continue going forward. Uh, what floor are we on now? Seventh floor. I choose left. Left was right. That totally made sense in my head. Here? Here. I think that is it. Are we up against Liquid Flame again? Nope, we're up against Hypnot. A new guy. 
hanging out in the wall. Hey, he had soft. I could definitely use that. Uh, I don't think anybody else needs to be healed. Um, but we'll just go for it just in case. Eh, she did need to be healed a little bit. Now Krill definitely needs to be healed. Wind Slash probably not going to do it. But an S shot with the Brave Blade just might. It just might. Yeah, doing math with the how much damage that is is very easy in my head. I love it. Did I steal from him? I think I did. It doesn't matter. It does not matter. What else was I going to be doing anyway? But this, this tower, it does take quite a bit out of you. There's no other way to put it. Critical miss! Ha! Oh, seriously? The sonic boom miss? What the hell is your problem, Krill? What, what the actual hell? Okay, down it goes. You have 625 experience, 5 ability points for that. What the hell, game? I just got 100. Now you're going to give me 5? What the hell is your problem, game? Let's just continue up then to the floor number 9. And I think I already found the right one because I got into another fight. I think it's just the two enemies there. Yeah, another Hypnot. Okay, and because the next floor is number 10. Before we do move on, I have changed Bart and Reina's job classes around a little bit. I don't want to waste any of the ability points. Of course, we are getting 100, so they are very close to mastering Thief and Knight, respectively. I don't want that 100 ability points going to waste. So I have moved them over to something where it will not be wasted. Up on the 10th floor, there are pots. Just every 5 floor, there are pots. You get 10,000 gil out of that one, and monsters out of this one. I spoiled it a little bit, but it's going to be yet another magic pot. Let's give them some elixirs. And once again, you get a phoenix down out of that chest. Let me switch everybody back so we can try to finish those off before we get to the next magic pot. Back on Night and Thief, and ready to move on. Got in a fight with a disabler. Just for the record, you can steal ribbons off the disabler, so feel free to try. Holy crap, did not expect something that nice. Uh, right. I guess I picked right. And correctly. Continuing on up, Bards is so close to mastering fighter. This one. Nice. Nice. Next battle should be enough for him, which is good because... It looks like there's just one more battle before the 15th floor in that next magic pot. As a result of that battle, Bart's did get that last job level up. He is now a Master Knight! So I switched him over to Sorcerer. You get Equip Shield... I'm uh, sorry, not Equip Shield. Equip Sword at level 6 for being a Knight. I don't think that's worth all the effort, but... We're moving on to Sorcerer! Now, so, well, more or less so that he can get a lot of experience quickly with that one. In terms of what he can equip, unfortunately, even though he can equip the Western-style swords, he cannot equip, equip either the Excalibur or the Brave Blade, so he's down to the Enchanter, which is not that great. Uh, Rain is over on Lancer, so that she can get some experience there. I don't think there's another level to, to Monk, so I'm not willing to, to try. Let's head up. And on the 15th floor, just like we have expected, we have more pot, including monsters on this side. I bet it's another magic pot. It requires two or three elixirs, usually. And once again, we get a phoenix down out of that chest. Time to move Reyna back, though. Getting closer. This is definitely a great way to get a lot of ability points very, very quickly. And if we head over to this treasure chest here, we can get 15,000 gil. And all of a sudden, those elixirs don't look that expensive anymore. Let's head up to the 16th floor. Over half... I would like to say that the second half is shorter, but there's there's really no difference. Let's just continue on as fast as we can. Hey, no fight that time. There is a fight this time, though. Let's see if I can avoid the fight this time. Not this time. Let's see if I can avoid the fight this time. I cannot. Too bad. But we do have a new enemy this time. Oh. Kuzer. Right, he has a potion on him. Uh, that's not great. Uh, as you can see, I am not in particularly fighting condition right now. So hopefully he doesn't have any big attack to start. Hey, I lived. That was close. 
God. Things are, things are not going so well for me. The, the, that fucking roulette, man. That roulette. Nothing to steal. I don't think I learned it either. Actually, it, it did hit Ferris, so it's not a blue magic. It, it just feels like it should be, to be honest with you. That looks like something that would normally be a blue magic, but not this time. Alright, I might need to switch Krill over to White Mage off screen so that she can heal. Because right now, I don't know if Ferris is, is, is doing good enough of a job here. A shot! Take me away! You don't. You, it does like half the damage that the Brave Blade did, I swear. But down it finally goes. Down goes the Coozer. 625 experience, 5 ability points for that. Not enough to get anybody up to the next job level. I don't think I need to heal, so we might as well just continue going forward. I don't think we're on the pot floor. We are on the pot floor. Okay, hold on. Okay, hopefully I don't get in too many fights here, because I don't have a very good party set up. I have a sorcerer, a bard, a summoner, and a dancer, just to be on the safe side. Uh, I know the bard will level up, uh, but everything else should be the same. And we get 20,000 gil out of that one, and a fight. Well, I managed to make it out of that pretty cleanly. So let's head over here, and we do have another pot with monsters inside. I bet it's another magic pot. It is. Another phoenix down out of that chest, and I went ahead and changed everybody around again. So Ferris is back on Chemist, and Reyna is back on Thief. In terms of the ability that uh, she did get for now mastering Bard, because she is now a master, um, Level 3 apparently is enough to be a master. Uh, she can now sing. You should mo move all the sing the songs forward, which is always appreciated. Let's continue on. We are getting there. Around level 20, I think it was. So we are getting to the top. It, it takes a little while. This is not something that you can do fairly quickly, but it is something that I do recommend you do. Even though we don't know what's at the top just yet, the magic pots make this all worthwhile. Wow, we are moving along this time, up to 24 again. So, after this fight, I'm going to need to rearrange my... Alright, quite a few changes for this one. Um, Sorcerer, Lancer, Red Mage, Red Mage. <laughs> Red Mage, because it takes forever to learn that. We might as well get some of that knocked out pretty, pretty quickly here. 25th floor! I believe this is the last one. But we do find monsters in there. Last one with the magic pot. And this is the magic pot? It sure is. And for that fight, we get an ab splitter out of that. Weird. I have used a total of 11 elixirs now. I had, I think, 26 to start. Now I have 11 less. <laughs> Let me rearrange my party again. 